Is it possible to determine what somebody's capacity is to understand how they hurt you or impacted you, especially when they have a mental illness? The capacity formula is as follows. So when we think about capacity, we're thinking about their ability to understand what they did wrong, their ability to understand their impact on you, but also their ability to choose a different action. Now their capacity is equal to their insight. So when we're talking about insight, we wanna think cognitive. Can they explain to you what they did? Can they talk to a therapist about it? If they were in a court of law, could they work with their lawyer or would they not understand why they're in trouble? Capacity is insight times Regulation. So this piece is about emotions. Are they able to emotionally regulate? Are they acting on every emotion that they feel? Or are they able to pick and choose how they act to some degree? So capacity is insight times regulation times agency. So sometimes people have a really great intellectual cognitive understanding of what they did wrong, and they actually have good emotional regulation, but they're still stuck in behavioral patterns anyways. Maybe this is because of an impulsivity problem. Maybe this is because of self-sabotage or an unconscious pattern. Whatever it is, sometimes people's behaviors aren't following what their hearts feel and what their minds think. I picked a multiplier here because if any one of these things is zero, it actually negates their capacity completely. If you have zero insight, it doesn't matter if you have good regulation and agency. And if you have really good insight and regulation, but zero agency, it doesn't matter if you're not able to change your behaviors. Now, all of these things are divided by the environment. It means that if you are tired or scared or traumatized or hungry or whatever it might be, your insight, your regulation, your agency might go up and down. Now, for the math nerds out there, your environment score is between negative one and positive one. So if the environmental score, let's say, is a 0.8, that's going to increase their capacity. But if the environment score is a minus one, then that's actually going to lower the capacity, even though these internal factors might be a little bit more stable. I was really blown away by how many people really enjoyed the accountability formula I have up here. Go check it out if you haven't seen it and stay tuned for more videos where I'm gonna answer more of your questions. If you have any additional ones, put them in the comments below.